Hello guys and welcome back. We're going to get straight into today's video. I've got two more codes for you. Now, I always try the codes just before I do the video to make sure they are valid. So the two codes I'm going to give you now will work. Um, when I push OK, it will just come up with a message, but I've already typed them in a few minutes ago. So let's get straight into it today. I always like to guys, look, no messing around. Just smash that like and subscribe button and drop a comment. That's all I ask for two codes. And also, guys, I want to give you guys a bit of a question each time. Who's your favorite cookie and why? Comment down below. Now, we've got two codes. I mean, you can pause the video right now, copy them here, and never listen to me ramble again if you really want to. Um, anyway, so we've got this one here, which is, I always have to try and say these, but I never know. Hol it, O A Y. Holla? No idea, but it's another YouTube code, guys. This is probably someone, um, a YouTuber. I, that's probably a YouTuber. They, they seem to be doing some codes just to, you know, help push along some YouTubers, which I always think is quite cool. Um, Cookie Run Kingdom does do very well on these types of, um, things of like promoting YouTubes. Maybe it isn't. I don't know. I'm rambling. There's the first code. If you're going to click claim rewards up here, we'll say done. But like I said, about two minutes before the video, I've already claimed this. I'm not actually sure what we get from these. We will check after I've typed them both in. And then we've got um, the second code, which I've just hidden now because I'm silly. We got the second code there, which is Hong Tu Tu. Again, no idea, but there's the code for you. They will also be in the descriptions, uh, descriptions, description, and pinned below. So there we go, guys. Nice and simple. Now let's take a look at what we've got today. Now I believe there's an update tonight as well at some stage, which. I'm quite excited to see. Let me re-enable it on my screen. Okay, so yeah, I, I I believe there's an update later on today as well. So my train levels are going through quite nicely. Okay, here we go. So uh, greetings of Kukuranta. The, the end date of the challenge time check event has changed slightly. So for any of you who are wondering. And we've also got the maintenance zone that I was discussing will be out today. I'm not sure what time that is in the UK, but it will be, it's the 9th. It'll be some point today, guys. Um, I think it's I think it's overnight because la last week when they did an update, I didn't see any downtime, but we will grab a few diamonds for the downtime as well. So can't really complain about anything. Now, let's have a look what we got. We got 600 diamonds. Can't really complain about that. 600 diamonds in the bank, guys. Lovely. So we're going to claim all of that and we get our 600 diamonds there, which is absolutely lovely just for those two redeem codes which again you can see we're going to start the video or checking out my cookie run kingdom playlist and i'll have everything in there that i've ever done so that is lovely indeed that is a very big amount of decent rewards there guys um but yeah so let's continue through here so i don't have too much of a plan for today's video um i want to tease you guys for tomorrow look at this i can get right up to six stars now that will be done tomorrow and i'm very excited to do it i've also got all this gear leveled up uh, but what i was doing was i started to work on this character so let's get her ascended i think oh yes i can do that now i oh it's going to cost me a lot of money actually but i wanted to get her ascended up guys because um i'm kind of preempting needing her to heal my characters uh for the later on levels to be honest with you um, I'm just going to save all my diamonds up now and uh, wait until the refresh and see what character they push in. But we can upgrade her here to level 51. Now I want to work on getting her up to 60. Uh, let's see how far I can go now. I think it's probably going to cost... I can get up to level 50, 57 straight away. Lovely. So we've got up to level 57. I need a bit more cash now. So um, going for the next few days, what I'll probably do is keep working on her. I, I've also had a lot of people tell me this character is quite good, but to be honest with you, I haven't really used him much at the moment. I have managed to get him up to two stars, which is very nice. Um, so yeah, uh, like I said, a lot of people have said that he's a good character. I'll just get him up to level 30. I, I might give him a go, actually. I wish, um, I would like some kind of like a test ground to try characters out, but um, yeah, um, okay, cool. So that's pretty good in Indeed. So let's take a look now. So if I go into like the um, seasoning of the dungeon here, I, I need to get money. Money, money, money is going to be my main focus. I wonder if now I can do this on the harder level, actually. I'm going to put the healer on. I probably shouldn't really use the healer. 
I might just drop this guy on. Um, so I don't really. Mm, his power level's too low, so. Uh, let me just put her on anyway, guys. I can't remember. Oh, this one's quite annoying, actually. Oh, well, let's try it. As you guys are watching, I've butchered this a few times with you. <laughs> with everyone who watches me, they know. Um, let's have a look. If I can't do it, it's going to be interesting to see is if I get to um, six stars tomorrow, if it's going to make too much of a difference or not. Um, but as you can see, there's quite a lot of enemies all spilling towards me now. We're going to shoot them all dead. There we go. I do like to kind of uh, make sure as I'm going through these these ones especially you've got to prioritize those uh, special characters when they appear i've just wasted my special because i'm an idiot shoot this guy yep lovely okay so we've got a bit of an attack speed now uh let's get the um thing out again there just so we've got a bit of a turret giving me some cover and fire as well rinse out most of those there and we can get the bomb out again and then i like to stay in that let's use her special as well just give me a bit of healing and then we've got another bonus monster there who just lovely kind of killed himself there and we're going to shoot everybody dead here like that and that just does a really quick clear out so again i'm not actually doing that well on this i'm probably not going to be able to um free star this one but um nonetheless uh, i wanted to give it a go and see oh we've got a healer he needs to be prioritized free get the bomb on him chuck the bombs out to heal Drop the teapot. One. Oh my goodness. Just going to spray down there. We've got the bonus monster killed again. Yeah. So this probably is not the best team. Oh, yes. I just caught that guy in it as well. Shoot. All oh, these people. Lovely. We've nearly got my bomb back. We've got 20 seconds. Um, this is not going extremely well at the moment. Bang. Bang. I don't really need a heal. Um, so probably the healer's not the smartest character to take into this, but I'll tell you what I have done with my fire character. I have done a very good build with, um, annoying that I just couldn't get my special out. I probably would have been able to push that if I was just able to get my special out at the end there. So I'm not too far off. Maybe I was just a little bit unlucky on that one. So, um, certainly probably knocking the healer off is going to be very useful for that one, but... Yeah, so that's giving me a bit more money. If I level up my cat a little bit more, I'll be able to clear that in no time, guys. So let's do a big raid here just to top my money up. I then I want to finish my healer off. Now, I want to have a healer maxed out. I know a lot of you are probably saying maybe I've wasted some supplies on this. I want to have a max level healer just for the story mode, guys. So there we go. And that's put her up to level 58. So by the end of today or tomorrow, I'll be able to get her up to level 60, which I'm excited for. Now, let's continue. So I wanted to give that new cookie a bit of a go that I've got. So maybe I just jump in and do like uh, the second one of these and just drop my bomb guy in in just to kind of see what he's like um, i'm going to be carried by my teammates here of course but i just want to see what he's like and i like to test it on the raids if i do the a thousand raid it's probably going to be a bit too easy um that i'm not going to be able to give him a proper go so yeah let's see we should be able to find someone i normally don't have too much of a struggle here um but yeah I i'll tell you what um I haven't actually had much time to play the raids. I I don't really like this boss because when you do the hardest one, it's just a bit boring that bit at the end. It's just like where he goes into invincibility mode, shoots bullets everywhere. And the drop rate is so poor, I just get fed up with doing it. Oh, he shoots a little poison bullet. Okay, he hasn't got a charge attack. Like I said, I haven't really played as this guy, nor have I actually read any of his moves. <laughs> so I don't really know what I'm doing. Um, but yeah. Let's have a look. So you shoot a bullet, which is just doing um, earth damage. And you do two poison. That did quite good damage, which is special. Ball. Drop, drop. Okay, so that dropped two big bullets on him. So it looks like with this, you, it's just powering up. Ah, okay. So it, it drops like a bit of a grenade. And if you tap... Okay, yeah. And because I've upgraded him, I can stack it up twice, which is quite nice. So really, I need to maybe read about him a little bit. Oh, he just, why did he just shoot three, <coughs> three bullets then? Two, three. Ah, it stacks up. Okay. So I need to see what his special was again, because I wasn't too sure about that. So he shoots that. One. Ah, it just does a double explosion and get bored. Bored. Three shots. Okay. So he's, he's quite cool, actually. He's get, 
Oh, have I done something to him? Because he's got that mark on him. So maybe I've done something to increase my damage there. Or is that because I shot him with the four bullets? I'm not sure. He's got the mark on him again here. Um, he's quite a good little character, actually. He seems to be doing a pretty decent amount of damage and stuff. Because I, I basically, I kind of want to get one of each, um, one of each element upgraded. So then when I go against bosses in the future, I can. Because obviously at the moment, I just use Rai for everything, which is fine. But I can see everyone getting a bit annoyed at me about that. <laughs> yeah, right in his head. Oh, I think that, that pierces as well, maybe. He's getting rinsed. He's getting rinsed. I love that someone's using Ginger Brave. Yeah, okay. Okay. So he's at... Oh, my computer's just started whirling up. He's actually quite a good little character there. Um, oh, yeah, I've got an upgraded one. What is happening to my character's head? I, I never get any good drops from this. How's that guy got two purples and a blue from a normal chest? Come on. I get done so dirty every time with that. But yeah, so he's actually quite a cool character. Let me just read about his move before I round up this video because I'm just rambling about nonsense now. So what's his passive? Direct hits are basically inflict a stack of fawns on enemies. When do when do fawns explode? It deals additional damage based on number of stacks. Damage increase. Okay, that's pretty cool. Uh, fast free horns that can pierce for enemies. That's pretty cool. Launches a bomb when it's hit or it explodes. Yep. Dash. And then he's got here. Launches a massive bomb. The Stinky King. The s yeah. And anyway, when an enemy is hit, don't explode until it's damaged. After it explodes, extra forms cause it. Uh, yeah, it's pretty good. And he's not got anything which particularly is kind of screaming like, oh, this is amazing. But nonetheless, I think he's a pretty cool character. So guys, make sure you subscribe because tomorrow we'll be getting right upgraded. And I'll see all of you legends in the next one.